my boy J. Cole just dropped another video, guys. G O M D. Get off my dick. Whoa. Guys, you all know that J. Cole is my role model. But guys, I wanted to do this review off of G O M D. Guys, I was expecting no role models to be maybe the next video, but I, I guess maybe they might come later. You know, all the fans are saying that they want him to make a video for uh, no role models, but okay. Well, I'll take G O M D for now. I'll take G O M D for now. Let's get to. The analytics of this video, okay? I actually like it. You know, it's giving me Django and Chain for some reason. I don't know. It's just giving me the slavery vibe. And at first, when I was listening to it, I'm like, I don't know if this really fits the song because it's talking about something totally different than what the video was talking about. But maybe I guess I guess you can't say the little African symbol at the beginning. We go on right now. So I guess you could say that's kind of like slavery and African culture like so I guess maybe that can some somewhat sum up what the video is talking about you know uh but I, I like the video honestly because you know it shows that he's got good acting skills for one okay I didn't know whether he was a bad guy whether he was a good guy but I guess he was playing a role as a bad guy you know just just, just to free all the blacks you know the the free the free the people from slavery because you know he's they chose him to be like the leader of the household because he's light skinned. I get the storyline, okay? It's it's it, it, because he's light skinned and no, the slaves were dark skinned. So you know I, I guess that can kind of sum up what the video is about. You know it was so Django and Chain and you know the way that they were the way that they was treating him. J. Cole on the video was like, you know, was treating him other than his race from what he really was. So I guess that can sort of sum up. It's a good storyline. As far as it coming up with the with the song, I guess so. I also like how the fact that a little segment in the video, they had like the Africans dancing, you know, kind of, and they kind of had, it was kind of a little... African uh, traditional type dance, you know, and I actually liked it, there, guys. Um, the song is one of my favorites on the album. I play the album nonstop, you know. So many people in the comments are saying, well, Kendrick Lamar is better than J. Cole. J. Cole better than Kendrick Lamar. J. Cole and Kendrick Lamar better than Drake. Y'all need to stop comparing these rappers because for one, J. Cole, Drake, and Kendrick Lamar are the best three rappers in this generation thus far. Okay, you can disagree to dis agree to disagree, but uh, uh, even though J. Cole is my favorite out of the bunch, I, I would still say I, I love Kendrick Lamar and I love Drake the same way. I, I wish people would just stop comparing artists to one another because that is just like so stupid. You know, comparing other artists, you know, it's not, it, 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 it really doesn't change the fact that J. Cole and Kendrick Lamar and Drake are, are all talented in their own way. So, I, you know what? Regardless or not, this video is amazing. I really love it. I, I, I like the storyline. It's different. And I, I, I'm just glad that he had, he always comes up with good storylines for videos. Like, uh, when he made the uh, uh, Crooked Smile video, that was one of my favorite videos of 2013, guys. I was just, I'm just, J. Cole is just my favorite. Y'all know, I, 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 I kind of idolize this man a little bit so this is forever burning tv get off my dick whoa